Welcome into the recap of the White Sox blowout loss to the Baltimore Orioles at Camden Yards at Oriole Park in Baltimore, Maryland on Labor Day Monday afternoon. I'm David Kaplan. It's brought to you by our great partners at Wintrust. They are the exclusive home of White Sox. Checking, scan the QR code on your screen, click the link, or go to Wintrust. Dot com slash White Sox for all the details and then you get your very own White Sox checking account that super cool White Sox debit card. Folks, when you play one of the best teams in baseball and they're trying to get razor sharp for a playoff run, you better bring your A game. When you give up seven guys with multi-hit days, you got no shot. That is loss number 108. I'll give you some notes on this game in just a moment. The Sox took a 2-0 lead in the first inning. Benintendi and Sheets with RBIs. And you look at it, 2-0 against Corbin Burns. You're like, wow, 2-0 against Corbin Burns in the first. Orioles come back and get one. And then, vroom, down goes the accelerator. And they blow the White Sox off the field. As I said, seven guys with multi-hit days. Quick look at the numbers for the White Sox. They got all of eight hits on the day. Uh... Flexen, Chris Flexen got the start. We'll get to an unbelievable stat about him in a minute. And then they finished it off with Ellard, Cool, Tucson, and De Los Santos. That is the usage out of the bullpen. In the bullpen today, Ellard gave up two runs. They were both unearned. Cool, he gave up four runs, all earned. Tucson, four runs, all earned. And then De Los Santos got one out to finally get them out of the eighth inning when the game turned into a complete train wreck. Uh, he was able to get a strike out of the one man that he had to deal with after a walk. All right, now let's give you some numbers on this ball game today. Some numbers that are frankly pathetic, sad, but true. Listen to this. The Chicago White Sox are four and 37 in the second half of the season. Four and 37, that's almost a, a stat that takes your breath away. I don't know how that's even possible. The record sits, as I just said a moment ago, at 31 and 108. And they set a record for Chris Flexen today. This was the White Sox 20th consecutive loss when Chris Flexen starts the game. That is an all-time major league record. Let me say that again. 20 straight losses when he is the starting pitcher. And he's had games where he's pitched reasonably well. It's not all on this dude. This team is a train wreck. They are absolutely horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Uh, our player of the game, brought to you by your Chicagoland and Northwest Indiana Chevy dealers. There's certainly no one on the White Sox I'm giving it to. Uh, we're going to give it to Gunnar Henderson. Uh, he had three RBIs today. He had a walk. He had a home run. And he had a big, big day. White Sox get their head kicked in. Horrible. Take that.